How's it going everyone? Today we're gonna win a single game of Sky Wars using each kit. There's just over 40 kits so if you could please leave a like to save my sanity. There is another problem I have which is that I don't own every single Sky Wars kit yet. One final thing to note is that I won't be using any mythical kit and the reason is just because each kit increases with price every time you buy one and I only have 75 as of making this. If you want to see me win using every Mega Sky Wars kit, let's go for an impossible like goal of 1000 likes. So without further ado, enjoy the rest of the video. Let's start with the default kit. Obviously this kit is pretty bad, so the idea here is to just rush middle, get all the mid loot, and hopefully win the game with that loot. I don't need any of these tools, so I'll drop them. Ooh, got some good armor here. I could even mine the diamonds with these pickaxes, but I'm just gonna start with looting the chest first. I hear someone behind me. Oh no! All right, we got a pearl. We actually, I think, just have mid to ourselves. So we're going to mine these diamonds. And I'm dead. Oh, this is so unfortunate. So, so, so unfortunate. All right, let's pearl. Hopefully get to safety. All right, well, we have a problem. We are 1 HP, pretty much. Oh my god, I killed one! That's so good for me, actually. This guy's on 9. He's pretty low. Actually, really low. Oh my god, I hit him. He's on 1 HP. Oh my goodness. I'm actually frying. Wait, I killed somebody. I'm kind of a bow god, I guess. Okay, where is this one guy? We don't have a chest plate, which scares me. Oh, he's right here. When all else fails, just bow spam, guys. And that is how you win with the default kit don't mind the name for this next game we're going to be using the armor smith kit it's actually pretty good you get an anvil some xp bottles and some enchantment books of course power and prot 2 sharp one we are going to try our best to take advantage of all these books and enchantment bottles so we're just going to mine these diamonds probably make a sharpness one we can even mine the iron just to be sweaty a little bit all right so we're going to make a iron chest plate here and put all this on we have some pretty good loot now and we might as well take our anvil with us because we got a sharpness one. We can maybe even make some better stuff along the road. And while you're done doing all your stuff, there's already two people left. So this should be hopefully a free game. As long as you play your cards right, you just got to get a couple good items and you should be set. We're going to eat a golden apple, get our absorption hearts up. And this guy might want to PvP action. All right, let's do this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. All right, GG, one heart to spare, but that's all because I had a sharp miss one diamond sword. All right, guys, we're going to be using Bat Guy for our next kit. This isn't really a good one. The only thing you get is blindness potion, some leather armor, and some spawn bat eggs for whatever reason. Ooh, two pearls off one chest is actually super good. And we got a bow, which you know what that means. Three pearls, okay. We're actually going to eat a golden apple right now. Maybe take advantage of our bow right here. Hopefully kill Steve or something. He's on 1 HP. Yep, you already know. I'm a bow god. There's a guy behind this guy, which he just got b-hopped on. Which, can I kill the b-hopper? No, please, please. I have a plan. I have a plan. This plan involves winning. All right, hit him with blindness. Yep, easy. All right, surely we win the game after killing the b-hopper, right? All right, I see him over here building. Can I hit him right as he jumps? Did I kill him? Oh my goodness, what a game to win. GG guys, and that's the bat guy kit for you. All right guys, for this next kit, we're gonna be using the cactus kit. For some reason, it gives you sand, which absolutely does nothing. In hindsight, it's just four sandstone blocks you can use to get yourself to middle. But even then, you have to craft it yourself. Not worth it. However, you do get thorns on your chest plate and helmet, so one might say that's good, right? I'm not too sure, but let's try and get a free kill here and then make our way to middle. Okay, we got to kill this guy. Uh oh, 1 HP. Yes, thank you. And we'll eat your golden apple. So I'm not sure if the Thorns 5 is actually good. So I will be replacing it. This I'm Radical guy is very, very low. How low is he? He's on 2 HP. I think the Thorns did something there. I'm Radical. Are you still low? I'm going to try and shoot you. You're on 3 HP, 1 HP. Okay, let's try and let's try. Surely not. That was super scary. So I'm Radical is might die soon dude i'm actually not missing any bow shots this is really cool no projectiles anymore which is fine and all we have left is i'm radical 
who hopefully has no more mid loot. Ooh, some prop for leggings. That's exactly what I need. This guy has two blazes, which are kind of annoying. See, this guy has mid loot, so I'm kind of afraid he might have like a knockback he's hiding. So I will try and keep my distance just a little bit here. Ooh, I have a sharp miss three knockback one. Wait a second. That's actually pretty good. How do you show the uh, durability that's left? I don't know. Maybe we can kill him before we need it. Oh. Oh my god. The knockback one saved me. <laughs> Holy crap, that, that sword is actually so clutch. I might have died there, almost. All right, guys, for this next kit, we are playing Disco, and it would only make sense if I won the game in Disco mode. So this kit, I would say, is probably a rushing kit, so I'm gonna try my best to get to middle as fast as I can. We're gonna leave our signature move, though, which is that right there, and then make our way to middle. I actually just ejected my disc. I don't need it, whatever. We got a pearl, a bow. This guy is has a sword and I'm very scared and I don't want to die just yet which I might yeah I'm gonna die here I actually have nothing we're gonna bridge up with our note blocks give me all of them I don't need a sword uh-oh uh-oh I might need a sword soon after all that time I did not get a sword from anybody yet all right dude it's come to that point where I literally need to make a wooden sword okay whatever so we've got waffles right here. Oh my goodness. Wooden sword comes in clutch. We have a diamond sword now. Big upgrades. Oh, and I just tapped out. Um, Somehow still won that in F5. And you heard the discord sound. I'm sorry, but hey, we won the game with the disco kit somehow. He said dope IGN. Thanks, man. Little does he know, it's just a nick. But yes, we are playing Ecologist. This kit actually received a couple buffs since the last time I played it. It's got sharpness on the axe, and so the goal here is just to rush middle, grab the chest, run away as fast as you can. That's literally it. Now, we only got two chests there, so maybe I should have gone up. I'm going to try and pearl up here. I don't know if I'm going to make that. I do actually make that perfectly. Oh my goodness. And it has exactly what I need, a chest. So this guy over here is gonna kill me nope i killed him first so we are kind of still in a bad spot just because we don't have any healing there's a guy right here trying to mine up but that won't matter because he's dead all this lava here man it's kind of helping me i think all right we have spotted the last person nice gg three kills with the ecologist kit all right guys for this next kit we will be using the enchanter kit now i would rush middle but i feel like it would be cheating if i didn't use some sort of the kit in some sort of way you know what i mean so we will be trying our best to enchant something now i have no clue where eight bookshelves will get us so let's see here how many will this give um 16 all right so we need 16 levels to do anything here i'm thinking since it's solo normal that a bow would actually be super good power two punch one in solo normal all right all right we need we need more arrows guys i would be so sad if i lost this also my game has been pretty laggy i had a really really bad incident the other day where something spilt inside my pc and i'm not sure if i let it dry long enough but i i'm sort of scared this person they've Quite literally killed everybody i have a power to punch one but i also only have 10 arrows left so like now would be my time to kill him oh if only dude okay this is actually my time power two man power two punch one. Oh, did i kill him there I'm, I'm actually very confused i don't know if i did Oh my god, that's actually so good. Power 2 punch 1 with the enchanter kit. First game, that's actually insane. All right guys, for this next kit, we're using Energix, which will give us a strength 1 potion. I feel like this kit isn't really good. It's kind of situational. I would say maybe if there are two people in front of you, you can use one to get strength already. Maybe to get yourself in a little advantage, especially if they kill that other person. Then you guys will both have strength for a split second and that will be your opportunity. This kit has already taken me the most attempts. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we got one of the kills. He had some time warp pearls for us and some boots and a helmet. 
Okay, this rod will be better than some snowballs. Okay, Daisy is low. This guy thought he could pearl on me. Silly guy. He had some golden apples to eat. This is going to be a pretty sweaty game. We will see if our strength potion will actually work for us. Oh, hell no. Oh, yeah. GG, guys. Get them both in a one by one and kill them with strength. Didn't even need to use my strength potion. I feel like that um, was no point. All right, guys. Everybody knows this kit. It's frog. You get a jump boost potion. It gives you a little bit of speed. The goal is to just drink the potion, get the first chest, run to middle. Okay, well, this guy's going to try and bridge to me. He's going to get knocked into the void. Not sure what he was thinking. We have a knockback, a bow, which is really good. Hopefully, snag that kill before he does anything. Oh, I actually did get that kill somehow. Not sure why or how. Yep, another kill with a bow. Dude, bows are in solo normal are just too good. I don't think they should have power on them, but that's just me with a controversial take as always. This might just be another bow spam game just because you know how this works. Okay, one guy has made it to middle. Nice, got him. We're just keep bow spamming this guy until he falls in the void. He was still low. Oh, why would he call me that? And for this last guy, he has the baseball kit, which you already know what that means. He has knockback one. In other words, that means we do not want to rush him. So we're going to try our best to just predict where he goes. Yes. Oh, I actually almost lost to that. All right, guys, we have our next game. We're using the healer kit, which hopefully will help us alongside killing people. We got some instant health potions and some regeneration, as well as one golden apple. So as long as we get some armor, which so far has not happened, we should be set. And that guy is dead who failed to loot all the good armor. Nice. Okay, let's go. This guy has all the loot, which doesn't matter because I'm destroying him. Give me those pants. I hear someone. <laughs> Uh-oh, we're in an intense bow action fight right now. I actually don't really want to fight you because there's someone behind you. But you're 1 HP now. This guy's aware that we have strength. I'm aware that he has strength now, but it doesn't matter. We'll just land all our bow shots. And one more person left. Poopism. Wow, what kind of name is that? Okay, I hear him behind me. Not good so far, but guess what? Instant health potion. And we'll get some golden apple absorption hearts going on here. Um, for some reason, he decided not to use his sword against us. It's fine, though. GG. And that's the healer class for you. All right, guys, for this next game, we are going to be using Rookie, and this will give you some blocks, a stone sword, and leather armor. Pretty much similar to the default kit, if you ask me. But basically, this kit will allow you everything to go to middle, so we're just going to make our way to there and waste no time. I don't really want to get those two chests. I feel like getting these two first would be better, so let's do that. Okay. Let's get this. Yes, thank you for allowing me to grab every single one of those items in that chest. We got some arrows and a bow. Okay, now we have a rod, which is also really good. Uh-oh, I hear, uh-oh, I hear an Energex potion being drank behind me. I hear three other people. This is really bad. I'm hoping I can land some shots here. Uh-oh. We're a little low doesn't matter though that and a golden chest plate we got one person left and they are unfortunately probably going to die oh they have mind a diamond sword i believe so i believe they're just gonna wait down there all good i'm just gonna get you a little bit lower before i finally decide to go in this might be the death for you actually almost killed me i will give you that the diamond sword will always help you out anyways that's the rookie kit well guys it's about that time we're in all the sweats are on but we're gonna try our best to win these games we're going to go scout now and as you can see we're slowly but surely opening more of these kits up so sooner but later we'll get them all but for this next game we're going to be using scout it gives you a speed potion obviously and we're going to try our best to get the best loot possible i feel like speed in sky wars is super op especially if you know how to use it so don't underestimate this kit you even get two of them and there we go we got the armor that i so desperately needed now all we're missing is a fishing rod or some projectiles i thought i saw someone behind me oh lovely okay we got one guy he also has strength which is fine 
and I'm lagging. I'm lagging so bad because my PC is frying itself. I believe I mentioned it earlier, but yeah, I spilt something in my PC, and I'm so afraid that my PC will just like corrupt itself, like when I'm almost finished recording all this. Fingers crossed it doesn't. So there's one more person left. We have one potion as well. So all we have to do is wait and find out where this guy is. Oh, we actually see him. He's in middle. He has leather armor as well. So that means this should be free as so long as he doesn't see us. Okay, this actually put myself in a bad spot. Got myself near the void, but it didn't matter. GG. All right, guys, we're going to be playing the armor kit now. It has a golden chest plate and a golden helmet. I feel like some of these kits are counteractive. I don't even know if that's the correct word. But what I mean by that is since you spawn with a chest plate and helmet, and that is literally all you spawn with, if you go to middle, get yourself a chest plate and a helmet, I feel like at that point, you just don't have a kit. Like you didn't even get blocks to spawn with. You didn't get a rod. You didn't get anything else. So I don't know. It doesn't really make sense to me sometimes about all this stuff. This guy got all the mid loot, but we killed him anyways. Thank goodness. Okay, put that chest plate on. He got a regular pearl. You have nothing. Come on, Dolly. Dolly 22. That's my favorite number. I also keep getting these lag spikes. So I'm sorry if this too uh, noticeable and it's um, annoying you guys. I will hopefully get it fixed. You're gonna try and clean me, sir? I heard I heard someone fall. Where'd you go? <laughs> yeah, that, that would make sense. Your last chance, I would bridge away too. And I believe this last guy is somewhere around here. We're thankfully gonna win this game with armor kit. Just bow him down a little bit more. Sadly, I have no pearls, which can help me kill him, but I don't think I need it. He said, ew, why are you good at the game? I'm sorry. I'm kind of choking though, so <laughs> GG. This guy's making fun of me, dude. I haven't played in years. You just got wrecked by a wash YouTuber, man. All right, guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the baseball player kit. Self-explanatory, you're going to get knocked back. So we're just going to try our best to make it to middle as fast as we can. Only got some leggings, unfortunate. So I kind of put myself in a bad spot. I do want to loot this at least one chest. Okay, nothing. This is unfortunate. Okay, so now we just have to play around the outskirts of the islands. Take advantage of my knockback in case anybody wants to try and fight me. And I'm prepared for running away. I got four stacks of 64 oak planks in my inventory. Oh, I can actually maybe even kill somebody. I hear some PvP fights. Okay, so you have strength. Oh, uh, one HP. Yeah, this is going to be a, probably a big L here. Look at my hearts. Look at that player. I hope you don't have a bow. Focus the good player first. Yes. See, you just got to make sure your priorities are straight. Well, if you look at that, guys, I've actually taken advantage of my knockback one sword to win the game. And that's how you use baseball. All right, guys, we're in this next game. We're going to be using the ender chest kit. And this kit is pretty interesting. It doesn't allow you to open this chest for a whole minute. And I believe that is because it gives you a singular mid chest spawn table loot thing, if that makes sense. It just gives you mid loot pretty much in one chest. The only issue is that it takes a whole minute to open. So like in that whole time, like I could have already been to middle at right now. You know what I mean? So obviously it wouldn't make sense to not take advantage of my kit. So in every attempt that I do, this is the fourth attempt. And we're going to open these chests. And we've witnessed two people fall off the void right in front of me. And there's already three people left. Still can't open my chest, by the way. Yeah, so that guy has everything, and I just now got the chance to open all my stuff. Awesome, we got some diamond boots and a diamond pickaxe. You know what that means, baby. Oh, we had iron leggings this entire time, didn't even notice, I'm sorry guys. And boom, just like that. We could even make ourselves a diamond sword before this guy comes and ruins our day. Do we know where he is? No clue. Let's go to middle. So in the meantime, we'll just play Fortnite. He thought it was a good idea to do that. Not sure why. Bye bye, chump chimp. And that is how you use the under chest kit. Just do nothing. Mine some armor, wait for your chest to spawn. Pretty easy. All right, guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the engineer kit. Now, this just gives you the basic necessities to make a trap. If you guys know anything about me, I don't know how to trap, and I'm not going to attempt it. I'm sorry. But there is one thing that it gives you that will allow you to use in combat PvP, which is the cobwebs. We take advantage of it right there. Use it again. 
Press my inventory, screw myself over. Press my inventory again. Use more cobwebs. Bow spam. That's the goal. Nice. So this guy is gonna die soon because I have a power one bow and he has zero armor. I do want to kill his skeleton though because that will cause some troubles to me. Thank you. I think it's safe to say that my eight cobwebs actually helped me out, um, especially in that situation. Um, I am hoping though that I can actually win this. Eat this golden apple, heal up a little bit, get that absorption heart. Oh, please. We don't talk about it. Almost lost, but yes, we won using the engineer kit. All right, guys, we're going to be using the farmer kit next. I would say this is the top five kit you should be using. There are quite a bit of good kits out there, but yes, this is definitely one of the top five, I would say. You get the projectiles and some armor, mainly the leggings, which is really good. And now I'm basically just half iron already, and this guy is probably going to make it out alive, unfortunate. But this guy wants to contest me, which is fine because I'm really stacked. And he decided to give me an extra golden apple, which is fine by me. We're going to get a kill there. Thank oh, you're alive. We're going to get a another kill here. Oh, I accidentally pearled him. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of sad about that. I could have used that pearl for something better, but unlucky. That guy went flying. Oh, there's a guy behind me. Didn't hear him. Got strength. Don't know what to do. I did get another pearl though from Black Magic, which is really good. We're just gonna hit him with our power bow here. Pearl on him. He didn't even see us pearl, which is fine. Almost died to him. Okay, we got one person left. Not really sure where he is. Let's make sure we have our eggs on standby. Oh my god! You actually scared me. You you actually scared me. Wow, we got an eight kill game. Not bad, guys. And that's the farmer kit. Pretty good. Top five. Definitely use it. All right, guys, we're going to be using the fisherman kit next. This obviously spawns with a fishing rod, a little bit of armor, but the fishing rod has a knockback one on it, which I believe is okay. I mean, it's basically just another baseball kit. If you think about it, this kit does allow you to also fish because it does have luck the sea and lure. I'm just not going to do that though, because I feel like that's just a complete waste of time. I do want to kill this guy and take his loot though. Um, I'm not sure if that will be possible unless I kill him and he tries to clean me. Will you try and clean me? No. I'm not really sure where he is. Oh, he's above me. Well, thank you. Because you decided to play a little bit scared, I decided to get even more stacked. If I got a better sword, that would be nice. So I'm just going to mine the diamonds. Screw it. I do need to mine this plank though because I need to make a crafting table. Boom. And just like that, I have a diamond sword. Okay, he's going to play like that, so I'm just going to go back middle. Not worry about that too much. Fine by me. Did he just fall in the void? <laughs> so I'm not really sure what this guy is doing. Um, interesting game, for sure. Also killed him from 53 blocks away. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to be playing Hunter. This kit spawns you with a power one bow and some arrows. We're gonna try our best to make it to middle. If we get a bow, it's kind of pointless, but if we get some enchantment bottles as well as another power bow, we can actually make ourselves a power two. So let's try and get that kill. Hit him once, which is good. Maybe get the kill. Yes, very good, very good. Let's try and put all this loot on very fast. Very nice. Nice. All right, guys, so far so good. We are pretty stacked. And we have quite a bit of bows. So we're going to use some of these enchantment bottles. We have an anvil conveniently placed right here. We're going to make a power two. Oh, this guy is shifting right here for some reason. <laughs> One hit was all it took. I like I was doing the rookie challenge. Respect. Also, guys, another reminder to leave a like on this video if you got this far. Again, if we hit 1,000 likes, I will try my best to do a mega Skywars video. Oh, that's, uh, that's a time warp pearl. Silly me. <laughs> GG guys, and that's how you use the hunter kit. Just rush to mid, make a power two. Alright guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the knight kit, which you spawn with a sharpness two, I believe, golden sword and a golden helmet. The sword, I believe, is just like 0.25, a little better than a sharpness one stone sword. So it's not that good. The idea is the same though. You want to get some blocks, make your way to middle. Some armor would help for sure. Ooh, nice. Some good loot there. Fully armored up now. We're going to try and get this kill here. Perfect. Like, I keep trying to do the challenge. I honestly really do respect that a lot. 
Okay, we got both those kills there. This guy's gonna try and come in, but he's aware I have strength, so he'll back off, which is fine. It's smart. I've had an iron chest plate. I need to get better at looking at my inventory, dude, because I always have better armor and I never realize. Ooh, abroad. So this guy's gonna try and clean us here. Oh, no way! Oh, that sucks. Got the kill, which means I got the strength, which means I can kill everybody here. Killing melon juice first. You're gonna die to fall damage. You're gonna die to my sword. Oh my goodness. Thank goodness. I actually almost died to that lava there, but the strength helped me out. GG. And I was using the golden sword, knight sword the entire time. All right, guys, we're gonna be using the next kit, which is magician. This kit is really, really bad. The whole goal they want you to do is to take all your armor off just to get a small chance to kill somebody and hitting them into the void. Personally, nowadays, it's just that doesn't work. You need to win the game and by taking all your armor off and making yourself super vulnerable, it's not worth it. Also, you get a sharpness for wooden stick, which is really bad. I'm pretty sure just using any sword would be better than that. But yeah, here we go. We're in Viz now. Super cool. No one knows that we're at middle for another 10 seconds until they uh, come up the stairs and get surprised by us. And holy crap, that's a lot of good armor. Okay, surely with all this armor, we win. Oh, stuck in a block. And I'm going to get a uh, bow spammed by Drewski here. But watch this. We're in Viz now. I'd rather focus this guy because he has a bow. Perfect. Oh, look at my bunny. Okay, there's four people left. We're gonna try and get some kills here. I'm not really happy with just one. There you go. Okay, here another guy above us. Could be wrong. Oh, was not wrong. Great, conveniently placed lava bucket right there. Let's make a sharp miss two right there. And there's a guy under us here. Perfect. Dreptness 2, Stone Sword, going in clutch here. Alright, with one person left, we have Max Nugs 13. We're gonna try and find him. Finally, we're gonna win the game using the Magician Kit. This kit took me about 13 attempts. I guess this kit is good if you wanna troll, but other than that, if you wanna try and win some games, I highly recommend avoiding this one at all costs. Alright, chest have refilled, and this guy's been shifted this entire time, but we got a compass now, so we know where to locate him. So the compass is pointing to over here. Okay, this, <laughs> this guy was mining or something the entire time, I think. Well, finally, we won a game with the Magician Kit. Did you guys? All right, guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the Pharaoh Kit, which gives you some armor and some building blocks. This kit will definitely allow you to go to middle. You don't really need to loot any chests. Sure, you don't get a sword, but that's why you go to middle. You just pray you get a chest here. Okay, we got a weapon. We got our pickaxe. Wonderful. Golden apple, even better. And all the chests are now looted. Kind of unfortunate. I didn't get anything good. Yes, I got that kill. Oh, he's going to come to me even though I have strength? Silly guy. Yes, nice. Somehow I'm winning. I'm not really sure how. <laughs> I'm just killing everybody, catching everybody off guard. There's three people left. Oh, you have strength. Didn't matter. Wait, I got that kill. Both of them. Somehow I'm winning. Okay. Oh, heard him. GG! <laughs> That's how you win using the Pharaoh kit. I still pretty much have half my armor. Alrighty guys, for this next game, we're gonna be using the Pig Rider kit. This is actually a really, really bad one. For some reason, it gives you a pig spawn egg and a saddle along with a stick and rod. But if you ride the pig, it literally does nothing. I'm pretty sure you just stand completely still. So I'm not really sure why they have that in the game, to be honest with you. Dude, all these chests are bad. What is happening? Okay, well, we have made it to middle, except everything at mid sucked. No good armor, nothing. All right, guys, let's demonstrate this this pig here. We'll put the saddle on. We'll put the carrot on the stick. Oh, my God. Look how fast he went. Wait. I He almost killed me. Okay, noted. So, apparently, that thing is to get away. We're going to probe with you. Nice. GG. Okay, there's one more person left. Thank goodness we're about to win the game with the Big Rider kit. Okay, this guy was shifted behind there the entire time. He has a diamond sword as well. I also have no, um, no blocks. We're still gonna win this game. I'm very, very convinced. Nice, GG. 
And that's how you win using the pig. Just don't use the pig. <laughs> All right, guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the grenade kit. This gives you a charged creeper egg and some leather armor that gives you some blast protection. Honestly, this kit's not really the best, but it's okay. Also, this is the second day that I'm recording this video. So this is actually my first game on. So hopefully we can get some dubs here. I already got some perfect loot. Put that stuff on. We're going to come over here. Use you. Get the kill. Steal the kill. And this guy's going to try and come over here to us. Come back. Perfect. All right, so so far my grenade kit hasn't done anything yet. It's just kind of chilling here. All right, Conrad. Hopefully my uh, creeper can TP to me and help me out here. It's not looking like that though. Oh, I'm scared. So, so far my creeper has done nothing but just kind of stare at me and do nothing. We have this Conad guy who is pretty stacked. All right, these last two are right here. This guy actually just got the kill as well, so we gotta we gotta be a little bit careful here. I'm pretty sure this guy's baseball. I actually can't land any shots either. Nice, GG. All right, guys, for this next game, we're going to be using the princess kit. This gives you a flame bow as well as some leather armor. You can choose the color, which is so kind of them to let you choose. This guy next to us has literally taken everything, so this kind of sucks, but didn't matter. I'm going to kill him. Wow. Put all this armor on real quick. Strength. Yes. Okay, goodness gracious. All right, so let's put these prop four pants on, some diamond boots, and we got our projectiles. Perfect. Okay, so we should be able to win the game now. We killed everybody that went to middle. We're going to use our flame bow now. What are you going to do against a flame bow? He's one HP. GG. So there's one person left. We have 12 more durability on our flame bow. Let's try our best to use all of that. Okay, this last guy has been spotted. We have 12 shots. We're not going to miss any of them for... Wow, yeah, we're just not gonna miss. Flame does kill him there. GG, guys. That's the princess kit. Overpowered. Guys, I am not having a fun time right now. We're playing the sloth kit. I've lost, I think, 10 in a row because this kit literally just does not give you a chance to win the game. You are entirely so slow. And when people want to team on you, it's super, super fun. Okay, besides me complaining, we're going to try our best to win the game. I'm tired of using it, so I really do want to win here. I don't really play this map ever, so I don't really know how the chests are. But dude, even when I walk, I'm so slow. Eat this golden apple. I can engage myself with some slowness too. Wait, does my slowness stack? Doesn't matter. Okay, somehow I'm winning. <laughs> Okay, we have an iron chest plate, prop one boots, some of that. We have a fishing rod, more projectiles. Okay, this is so far looking good. Oh my god, there's a level 90. Okay, so we're actually going against a level 90 for our last guy. He's drinking a potion. Not really sure where he is. Dude, I have to go against a level 90 with the sloth kit. Like, this is so fun. Oh my god, I won! I won! The sloth kid against level 90! Oh my god! Holy shit! For this next game, we're gonna be using the snowman kit, which gives you a snowman to spawn and some coal blocks. So we're just gonna run immediately to middle here. Waste no time. Hopefully we don't get knocked off. And then we're gonna place our snowman. Boom. Um, so yeah, my snowman actually killed somebody, which is really good. Snowman, will you kill somebody else for me, please? So honestly, for this map, it's actually a really good kit. I mean, it's one bow shot, and I'm pretty sure my snowman is dead. But like, after that, I've already gotten a kill or two. So I do have full mid gear right now. Oh my goodness, I got another kill. Love that. I swear I really haven't been doing much. I have two pearls to like actually make the game go by a little bit faster. But we'll wait till more people are dead to, to use those. One more shot. Uh, he's gonna steal my kill. Oh, I'm sad. I actually... I got the kill, and this guy's 1 HP. All right, game's almost over. We got two players left, and my snowman is still alive. This is really good. I would love to, like, TP to these guys and, like, end it, but I also don't have any projectiles. All right, so let's see if my snowman will do anything to help me out here. We're just gonna engage in nothing. Did he fall into the void? Did my snowman do something? Wait, where'd he go? Did he pearl? Where did he go? Wait, I think my snowman's looking at him. He is! My snowman is looking at him! It has aimbot! And it died to my snowman, finally. 
That's funny. Okay, so apparently Snowman is just completely broken on this map. I would just pearl to him, but he is full iron pretty much. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. One HP in a dream. Snowman, help me out here, Snowman. All right, Snowman's going crazy. I believe it's lagging him back a little bit. He's going to kill him now, right? Surely. Okay, Snowman is finally dead. It only took about half the game. So unfortunately, this guy is completely stacked. I'm not really sure. Oh, literally everything I needed was in that chest. That's quite literally so good. All right, so now the only issue is I don't have any gaps. Now, the idea here is to like TP to him soon. Right now. Screw it. Boom. Yes. Catch him off guard. That's how you win the game. And I'm pretty sure my snowman got like two or three kills there too. So GG guys. All right, guys, for this next kit, we're going to be using Speleologist. This kit honestly is not that good compared to others. So we're just going to try our best to get some free kills. We're going to rush the other island. And since we have an efficiency three, we're just going to mine everything. We might as well. We have two diamonds here and we have two back at my islands. All right. We can make a chest plate there. That on. We have an iron helmet. And you know what? Screw it. Let's make some boots. And just like that, we didn't even go to middle, but we're pretty stacked. We still have our pickaxe. Now all we have to do is win the game. Okay, so this guy actually has the Thundermeister kit, I believe. It gives you a golden axe, which does some damage. Ooh, almost died of that. And now we have mid to ourselves, so we can actually just mine these diamonds here. Okay, we made two diamond swords here. We're going to chair both of them. Oh, there's somebody mining under us. Bane of Arthropods, love that. And a sharpness. Now the thing with this Speleologist kit is that I can just mine. I can go mining. We found him! We have found him! <laughs> okay, this guy's going up, I believe. I heard him go in the water, so we're just gonna go up now. Not really sure where we're playing UHC and Skywars, but hey, this is how the game is nowadays. Ooh, TNT, which is even better. I can actually blow that guy up if he decides to start mining even more. But he's gonna give me the opportunity to come in and kill him here. Or not, really. Why are you in a boat? I'm so confused! Okay, well, this is a very interesting game. For some reason, this guy decided to just do his thing speleologist kit though we got this easy gg guys and that's how you win using the speleologist kit thankfully i could show it at its full glory while this guy was mining inside the map all right guys for this next game we're going to be using the warlock kit this gives you three potions it gives you poison instant harming and what's the next one weakness yes weakness so ideally you do want to use the weakness right as you're about to get into a fight be careful not to splash yourself though Oh, wow, that guy just lagged back and gave me literally everything. This is so good. Okay, so this guy's going to try and kill me. Can't can't hit him. Okay, so far, we have a pretty good game. We have all the mid chests secured for us. We just got to win now. Okay, so we're going to get targeted, which is fine. One bow shot and I'm dead. I have no healing. This is really sad. Perfect. Okay, I got my healing there. There's a guy behind you. Can I kill him? I can, which means I got strength. Okay, this is very scary. It always is. But thankfully, we are winning. We got a better chest plate. To use our potions to win the game now. Okay, we got one person over here. God Squad Gamer. Now we just got to look for Bubster, which he's right here. Hello, you have a diamond sword. Okay, so we're going to use that on you. That on you. I feel like that did a decent amount of damage. So that's really good. Boom. Yes, okay. The diamond sword actually almost saved that guy's life. And this should be a free win, Peter Griffin. Thank you so much for the win. Seven kills with the Warlock kit. GG, guys. All right, guys. For the next kit, we're going to be using Cannoneer. We're just going to use the TNT to actually rush to middle. Now, you could use this to, like, TNT yourself to mid, but we're not going to do that. I feel like back then that would have been viable, but nowadays you need all your hearts to even have a chance to winning. And wow, this is so slow. Okay, we just need a weapon here. We're getting shot at. That's fine for now. Okay, so my only weapon is an axe. I don't have a chest plate. Let's eat this golden apple now. We're gonna make our way up the stream. This guy's this guy's enchanting, I think. No, he just has no armor. I was gonna waste a pearl on him, but don't need to. <laughs> what? Nice. And we killed him with the strength we got from knocking that guy into the void. Alrighty, and these last two have been spotted. You get killed, and then I'm gonna pearl you to your face and then kill you. Cause who do you think you are? Yes! Oh my goodness! I almost died! GG though! Alright guys, for the next game, we're gonna be using the Enderman kit. This gives you a corrupted pearl that you can use after 30 seconds, so it's okay. We're gonna try and kill this guy who's taking all this loot here. Thankfully, we just got him into a corner, and he's fallen into the void. And I am gonna kill this guy with strength. Thank you very much. And just like that, we have mid to ourselves. Oh, one more person here. Um, so if I kill you, I get strength, but I didn't kill you, so I have to run away now. 
That was scary. Oh! That was really scary, but we did end up killing him. We have no projectiles. I do desperately want those. We can maybe use this lava bucket to help us. Uh, this guy's gonna bow spam us, which will work because this is solo normal. Keep in mind. Okay, so this is how we're gonna play. Very, very excited. Yes! This guy's flitting stealing me, silly guy. That won't work. Okay, two more people left. We got great cow. This I wonder if this guy is also standing. He's doing the same exact thing can someone explain to me what this is this guy was playing yesterday i killed him and now he's doing the same exact thing that he was doing yesterday just moving at his spawn island i'm interested to see this guy's kd i want to know how low it is because if that's like all that guy does is go afk at the start of the games his kd surely has to be like zero we do have one more person left we have our corrupted pearl to pearl to him we just have to find him now guys i think i found him there is uh wood stuff up there okay oh you get i can't i can't move how long is that slowness okay so you get slowness i never knew that that could have been really bad but it did not matter gg all right guys for the next game we're going to be using the guardian kit this will give you some obsidian and some spawn eggs for zombies and skeletons Ooh, that one actually got armor i don't believe they spawn with armor every time so that's a pretty rare chance we're just going to make our way to middle hopefully get all this mid gear and i really hope i get a pearl or two because i ooh, it just spoke into my existence nice this guy's going to try and make his way to mid but that's fine there's a lot of people there i'm not going to worry about it i do want to loot every single one of these chests now i have a chest plate which is really good all right guys we are fully stacked i would be super surprised if we lost this there's already three people left dude the game hasn't even been like active for like 30 seconds that guy was a one hit he also had an anvil for us so we can easily make a sharpness two right there and guess what sharpness three maybe i'm not even using my own kit but yes sharpness three just had to secure the w we do have a pearl we just are missing a helmet which is fine i don't think this guy will kill me i have a sharpness three let's be real Oh no, he's literally at middle. He's been at mid this entire time. We do have a resistance potion. Let's just pearl to him. He doesn't have any mid loot, so that's going to be a free game. GG. Nice. And we actually won. Sadly, I only got two kills, but look at that. My skeletons are still alive. I'm pretty sure my zombies are around somewhere too. Yep. All right, guys, we're going to be using the Jester kit. This kit is actually not good whatsoever. Half the time you get a wooden or a stone sword with smite on it, and it only has like five durability on it. All right, we have a stone sword. Let's see what enchants we got. We got looting too. Wow, guys, that's really good. As you guys know, in Skywars, with looting, you can actually get nothing when you kill somebody. So it's just a cosmetic. Okay, there is quite a bit of people around me. So I am going to run away. I do want to kill one person and then hopefully get strength off the next. Okay, we killed one guy. We're going to go back to mid here. I think I'm just going to yellow it. We still have a looting too stone sword. It's going to break on us very soon, so... Yes! Oh my god, I don't need the sword! I don't even need the sword! Okay, we have to win this, surely. We're gonna bow spam this guy. He's on 1 HP. Perfect. GG, guys. And that is the worst kit known to man. Alluding to sword, are you kidding me? All right, guys, we are gonna be using the pyro kit. I would use this kit if you're good at using flint and steels and lava buckets. That's mainly will your shine. Also, I got full armor already, which, okay, I'm gonna get knocked into the void here. This guy is spooking me. Don't take my kill. Okay, we're still getting bow spammed. Please stop. I would appreciate you if you stop. Okay, we have one issue now. We don't have any blocks. Okay, we're going to use our fire res now, and then we're going to get bow spanned by this guy. <laughs> no, I'm 1 HP, I'm 1 HP. He's 1 HP. I'm the better bow god. Let's go. Honestly, I would be so interested to see if anyone has kept track as to how many bow kills I've gotten this episode. I feel like it's at, it's got to be at least 15 players, right? I don't know. I feel like I've been bowing everybody, and I'm sorry if that's, like, bad. Oh, we found the last person here, actually. Okay, so we're gonna have to try and kill him here with our lava bucket. We're gonna get our tools in our hot bar. We actually don't have a really good sword, so I'm gonna fix that by making a diamond one. Okay, so now that we have a diamond sword, we can easily go to this guy over here. Nope, not trapping. But we did just put him in lava to finish the game. GG, guys. That's the pyro kit. All right, guys, we're going to be using the salmon kit. 
I'm not sure why, but I am struggling to win with it. I could literally just play like the most scummiest person in the world and do nothing. But I do want to like at least kill people instead of getting one win. Uh, but we got one kill there. We're going to get the other one here with strength. Please die. Thank you. We're going to put it on his armor as fast as I can. Boom. All right. So we have armor now, which is really good. We're going to get another kill here. He's going to give us a chest plate. Oh, yes. Very good. Very good. Let's use a fish here. Perfect. Did I actually save him? Nah, he got knocked off. But I got to be careful because these guys have strength. I also have strength. Everyone's chasing me. This is good. I love it. Isn't it nice when things go your way? Wonderful. We got eight kills. We can maybe even get a nine kill game. Not really sure where the last guy is. All right, we finally spotted this last guy. I don't think he's seen me yet. He has now, that's for sure. I actually meant to hit him with my salmon there, but it did not work. But hey, we got a nine kill game with the salmon kit. GG guys. We're going to be using the slime kit now. This gives you some feather falling for boots and slime blocks. Just be careful though, because walking on the slime is very weird. What's up, friend? Okay, we got a kill. There is some PvP action fights going on over here. Let's get this kill. I did not get that. Not good. Dude, lava bucketing is so good in this game. Another reminder, guys, since we're getting super close to finishing this video, to leave a like on this. If we hit 1,000 likes, I will go and finish Mega Skywars, which, if you guys don't know, that's where I originate from. Before my Skywars account got hacked, I had 100,000 Skywars kills, and I would say about 80% of those were in Mega Skywars. All right, so this guy's on 1 HP. We're going to rush him now. He is going to eat a gap, but doesn't matter. Thank you very much. Just be careful using the slime blocks. That's all I say. All right, guys, we're going to be using the troll kit now. This kit is okay. You get the cobwebs, which is the only thing good about this, which thank you for the boost to middle. So we do want to get some gear here. We're going to get another kill. I wonder if I got both of those, actually. Nice. Nice, so I actually was only able to kill him because I got strength off those guys. Other than that, I don't think I would have had a chance against that guy. Uh-oh. Nice. Almost scary, but we still managed to win. There's still quite a bit of people left, so hoping I can get this dub. Okay, we got him stuck in a cobweb, which is really nice. Okay, some guy just decided to come up behind me. So I actually have to go to this guy now because he is doing his thing nice oh there's actually a guy over here he's trapping i think or not perfect he actually led me straight to him gg and that's just with the uh cobweb i used one single cobweb and it actually helped me out a little bit all right guys we're on to one of the last solo normal kits that i can play we're playing zookeeper which will give you three random spawn eggs this kit is actually super super bad oh my gosh i'm so happy i survived there but a lot of the times you're gonna get nothing zombie pigman zombie and ocelot so like that's just not good okay we got that kill which is nice he'll back up just a little bit okay so we're kind of looking okay we just got to make sure we don't get knocked into the void and we can win our pvp fights Got the first one. There are two more people right here. Hopefully I knocked him into the void, which is, I did. So this guy right here is gonna give us the most issues. I hope I can kill him. Oh my goodness, did I just win the game? <laughs> I should have not won that. Three kills though, GG, Zootopia on top. Well guys, that goes to show that I've completed the challenge. I just got the achievement unlocked, Kit Connoisseur. Win a game of solo, normal, insane Skywards with every single Skywards kit. So this does not count the mythical kit, which is pretty nice, as well as the Angel's Descent kit, which I cannot even access because I don't have it unlocked. If you guys got to the end of this, please make sure to subscribe and like the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. This really took a lot of time, and I'm not sure what other content Skywars has to offer. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out, guys.